Eigenvector centrality is a measure of the influence of a node in a network. It assigns relative scores to all nodes in a network based on the concept that connections to high scoring nodes contribute more to the score of the node in question than equal connections to low scoring nodes. It is determined by performing a matrix calculation to determine what is called the principal eigenvector using the adjacency matrix. Did you get that? No, neither did we. Here's an example. This is me. And these are all my friends. Yeah, I'm a pretty popular guy. This red dot over here, that's Charlotte. She's one of my friends. And besides having me as a friend, she also has two other friends. Pretty cool, huh? Now, at a first glance, you would say that I'm better connected than Charlotte. However, the concept of eigenvector centrality doesn't just take the direct links into account. It also incorporates the links of the connected nodes. In this case, my other friends only have me as a friend. Charlotte's friends, however, each have three other friends. Using the eigenvector centrality, this means Charlotte actually scores higher than me. To put it in numbers, I have a degree of 4 and an eigenvector centrality score of 0.091. Charlotte, on the other hand, has a degree of 3. But due to her friends being well connected, her eigenvector centrality score is 0.182. Trust us, we ran the numbers. A node can have a high eigenvector centrality if it has many connections in the network. Or, like in the example, if it is connected to individuals who have many connections. Now let's consider the Dutch railway. A few years ago, the only way to travel to Zwolle was through Utrecht. It was the only station that was connected to the four largest stations and Zwolle, giving it the highest eigenvector centrality score. In this case, having the highest score is not necessarily a good thing. If something goes wrong at Utrecht station, as it often does with the Dutch railway, Travelers throughout the country could feel the effects of these problems. One of the ways the Dutch railway tried to lower the eigenvector centrality score of Utrecht was by adding an additional connection between Amsterdam and Zwolle, evening out the scores. 